outside and have a remaining fire. Okay, okay. Uh, help me out here, please. Holy crikey. Everything's coming at you now. doing Minerva's Den DLC, so let's just call this the last one. Well, this rapture in this present state. And then, Father, the rapture dream was over. You taught me that evil is just a word. Under the skin, it's simple pain. For you, mercy was victory. You sacrificed, you endured, and when given the chance, you forgave. Mm. Always. Mother believed this world was irredeemable, but she was wrong, Father. What? We are Utopia, you and I, and in forgiving, we left the door open for her. How did the thing, I was gonna say, how did the thing get flooded, but I know, so, you know, because it blew up. The rapture dream is over, but in waking, I am reborn. This world is not ready for me, yet here I am. It would be so easy to misjudge them. You are my conscience, Father, and I need you to guide me. And when I need you, 
will be there on my shoulder, whispering. The lighthouse. Utopia is not a place, but a people, and we must choose carefully, for the world is about to change. And in our story, Rapture was just the beginning. And there we go, Bioshock 2. It was good! Not as good as the first one. Nothing will ever top the first one. That was a perfect game, but it was still pretty good. The plot twist. That's what made it for me in this game. So I'm probably going to give it a 7 out of 10. And yeah, um, the ending, I think it in one of two ways. Either one, you become Eleanor, and now it's kind of living on through her, or you're just her conscience now. Even though you never spoke. I don't know. Yeah, that was overall, and I hope you guys enjoyed. And when I come back, I'll be doing Bioshock Infinite. See you then.